Hey guys, Kills of Frills here. We are back with some more Sons of the Forest. I have a little tutorial to show you. I have looked high and low for the ability to be able to do this, and I couldn't find a video or anything on it anywhere. So uh, I'm going to show you how to build the rope bridge. It's quite easy once you get the hang of it, personally. I'm going to reuse some stuff here, and I'm going to take this stuff with me. But first, I'm going to show you over here under the uh i think it's this mode so we've got the rope and then the rope bridge following this sometimes could be a bit of a pain right okay so i couldn't get it to work and i've seen a lot of people commenting and asking like how does it work how do you get it to work how do you do it so this diagram's a load of rubbish believe it or not i don't actually follow that diagram at all so what i can do is i'll show you how to i'll quickly run through it show you how to make one so what you do you should get it so you can get it in a circle and you just smash it into the ground. All right. I generally just uh, stick another beam onto the side there. We're going to get attacked in a minute because this place is horrendous for those mud dudes. Pick up another beam. Prop it up. Easy, right? Easy as that. That's the beam. That's the frame done. Now you need to get a way to get up there. So what you could do is you grab a couple more bits of wood. Smash one in there smash one in there now if you really want to be fancy you can put some stairs on it or you can just run up as is really so you see that that'll make a ramp that'll put some stairs sideways we generally want stairs okay so stair stairs 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 to change the uh, angle you just right click and he changes it so you can um make it a ramp or stairs I'm going to pump out some stairs quickly okay so that looks all right so we've got the basic frame set up this is the start of the bridge that i'm going to use so what you do now just go to your inventory select your rope with the left click come up to the top of the frame it's a bit janky on the stairs and you'll see this little arrow will appear okay left click that's all you got to do and you'll get this little icon and then you can run it over to where you want it to go you can kind of pre-measure i mean the distance is pretty damn far like, it is pretty far. I mean, look how far that goes. That's big, right? The best thing about this, right, is you can actually swim with it. You, well, I mean, it's not going to work because it's coming backwards on itself, but you can actually swim with it. So you can actually build it across really deep lakes. You can't build it in the lake itself, but you can build it off across. And the distance is, is quite far. So, all you need to do... Come over to an area where you want it. So I'm just gonna I'm gonna smash an area about here. This is only a little tutorial anyway. So I'm gonna say about here. Now you just build that same frame on the other side. I'll just pump that out quickly. Okay, so that is built. Alright, so I basically just duplicated the frame that I've had on the other side. So now I'm gonna select my rope. I'm just gonna do it from this side because I, I prefer it to be honest. Come up here. Get that little arrow up. Wrong way. Get that little arrow up. That's it. And then you come over here. And then just... You, it will just attach. See? Just left click. And now you'll get this other notification to say that you can do it again. And then just left click. That's it. Rope bridge is up. Now all you've got to do is grab your old bits of wood that you want to use. Go away, bird. And then just left click. And you'll see that he'll just start pumping it out across. Like that. Or, if you don't want to have to keep doing that, you can just pick up wood that you've already used. Come up here. And just left click. Drop the wood on it. And then keep going until it's all the way across. I'm going to do that now. Just so you can see what the outcome's like. Now, you can build this from the opposite side. We've got, got some company over there. You can build it from the opposite side. You see it's got the, the left click plus the tick at the bottom. But if you'll do it from here, it still builds it. But it builds it from the place where you started the uh, rope connection from in the first place. So it'll always place it on the other side. And there we go. Rope bridge is built. That's it. It's as simple as that. That's all you've got to do. That is how you build a perfect rope bridge. I mean, it's not perfect. It's a bit... It's a bit off it's a bit out of shape but it works it doesn't have to be accurate it doesn't have to be like lined up perfect because it still builds and that is how you do it nice rope bridge 
Easy as that. And like I said, you can span that across anything. I could probably build it across the other side of the lake if I get it on the end point. It doesn't matter how deep the water is as long as the other side is capable of having one built. And there you go, guys. So, yeah. Thanks for coming. Thanks for watching. And I'll catch you later. Bye. Thank you.